<laughs> have you ever um like been speaking to a, a couple who were pricks and you like and you hate them and then in the break they're not there so you couldn't them off but they moved yeah that's the worst oh, one like where you're like oh fucking glad them two pricks they have gone into the show and they're, and they're like where are you the and you're like oh fucking oh, worst <laughs> thing. especially here because you can't get out you have to go past them don't you to get off like to get off the stage, yeah. you have to walk past Didn't the audience. Didn't you nearly get fucking... I thought you were going to get battered here once. Yeah, but I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Why? Because I don't. Just in case he's watching. Yeah. <laughs> fucking nearly got hands and feet put on me, mate. <laughs> and at elbows, knees and fucking toes as well. We have put that on the Patreon, Patreon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, mate, I was proper scared. Because it was like... It's not just like... Oh, someone wants to. It was like if he heard what you said, you would be dead. Yeah, yeah, because he's a bad man, wasn't he? Yeah, but he he went just as like he just left, and then I said something, but it wasn't even about him, you know. It was just something that apparently he would have been angry with. Yeah, yeah, and I, I, I mean, I, I vaguely heard the story. I mean, we, we, we're, we're, we're skating around the issue, aren't we? Yeah. <laughs> Basically, what it was is that it was someone who's dead hard. But he's also very religious. Yeah. And then he he didn't have beef with me. One of the acts did something like about religion that was yeah. bad. He said that something was bad. And then this guy was fuming, got up to complain or to leave because he he wasn't happy with the blasphemy. Mm. And I just went back on and went, "How can you be mad about that when like I can't remember like." Priests fuck kids. <laughs> like, don't worry about a bit of blasphemy. Like, yeah. there's priests that fuck kids. Like, be mad at that. <laughs> Which I think is a valid point, yeah. though. And he, but he wasn't there. And then the bounce came over. He's like, "You, you're the luckiest man in here tonight because you'd have been a dead thing if he'd have heard that." And then, and then I was like, well, I have to put me fucking. It's an, I said, sorry, knuckle duster. No use for you tonight. <laughs> Thought he was getting a little out in Dusty. No, I would have died. I'm not hard. I'm a pussy all me. I hate fighting and that. Yeah. Not. I like pretend fighting. But like, I think real fighting. It's, it's People horrible. who fight. I, I, know, I, 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 we, I end up mixing with a lot of fighters. I always ask the same question. Like, because. I got punched in the face. Like I got punched in the face yesterday in sparring. And when you get punched in the face in sparring, it's like, you know, just ra it's like, it doesn't hurt. It's like getting in the head with like a flight, like a footy. Do you know right, what I mean? Yeah. Or but it's just the like impact and you go, uh, and I can't, I've got like a weird laugh reaction to it. And I go, ha, I've just got punched but in the face. But this is what I don't understand. It, when you see people get elbowed and shit in the head and their head just goes, and you're like, Ugh. But even that, like when you said, oh, if someone said to me, hey, sit there and I'll kick this footy at your head. I'd be like, no, <laughs> like, I don't understand like why, like we're not designed, that's not, we're not designed for that to happen. That's not a good thing. So even if someone went, yeah, let me give you a Chinese burn. I'd be like, no, because my life's better without that. Yeah. I don't need that. It, it hurts. Why are you doing that Can for a lot to call it a Chinese burn? Though? Oh, I don't know. But I know that some places call it an Indian burn. Mm. I don't know. I don't know why that is. I'm telling you what my dad calls it. Um, <laughs> your dad calls it deserved. <laughs> uh, did you get whacked? You, Brexit like, twist. Like when you were a kid, did you? Did your mum and dad used to. Uh, my dad that? never hit me. He never had to. He used to raise his. Um, yeah. My mum used to. My, my, my mum battered. My mum hit me once with Henry Hoover. <laughs> snozzled me. Yeah. Fucking End of it. snozzled. That's. <laughs> Yeah. Fucking like whip, whip sounded action. like a didgeridoo. I thought Rolf Harris was in the house throwing <laughs> down. Like wah, wah, wah. fucking boom like that. And like twatted me with it. Where did it hit you? Like all over. She just kept it in you. She sw she's proper swang in it like. <laughs> One was in the neck. <laughs> and I do it. Sometimes I mention it on stage and I don't want to be the guy that does the punchlines. Yeah. On podcast. But it's true. Like. As she was hitting me with it, because she took it off his, she took his nose off. So Henry's just there with no nose, fucking smiling at me like a psychopath while she's fucking <laughs> hitting me with it. So I'm looking down and he's just like, ah, big fucking smile on him. Prick. <laughs> when, when you need to look down, he'd got angry though. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, but he, he, the look was like, he was fucking enjoying he's it. smiling like, like a red prick. <laughs> Mad. 